Hey guys, I'm going to do a little bit of a haul of things I bought at Vitamin Shop recently. Okay, so I'm going to show you the products and I'm also going to do a taste test at the end. Um, so Vitamin Shop just had a sale. It was like buy one, get one 50% off. Um, so I kind of stocked up on some things. I, let's see where... So I really like the Oya oh yeah, One Bars. Um, not that long ago, I actually bought a whole box of the peanut butter pie. So I didn't buy any more because I still have quite a few. But now I bought a box of the birthday cake. They taste like animal crackers. They're really good. Um, and I also bought another box. Um, this one is of the Almond Bliss. These ones taste like Almond Joys. They're a little bit higher in calories. Um, they're about 10 more calories, 10 to 20 more calories than the others, but they actually have uh, whole almonds in them. So they look and they taste like Almond Joys. Uh, Lauren Losing turned me on. She, who hasn't she turned on to something? Um, at WSFA, we had like, basically I felt like boxes of this stuff in our room. I'm pretty sure I ate like two bags of hers and now I like see how expensive they are. I feel a little bad for eating so many of them. Um, this stuff's amazing. <laughs> so I actually stocked up on it. I guess I'm not giving you the stats for stuff. I apologize. Uh, the stats for this is one serving is 80 calories, um, three carbs, and 12 protein pretty good i would say for carbs when it comes to having the name honey in something so really good i'd recommend giving it a try you can also find them at um like a safeway chain a kroger chain so we have them at fred meyers here and then vitamin shop sells them as well uh i wasn't joking i really like the one bars so uh, I bought a couple more. This is the lemon cake one. So the peanut butter pie and the lemon cake I'll actually eat around breakfast time because they have more of the lighter kind of breakfast taste. Almond Joy birthday cake. Uh, I eat more like afternoon. I got a few more of these. I wouldn't recommend these. Well, like I love these for runs. Uh, when I'm running my long runs, I definitely have these on me. They are the Cliff Shot Blocks. They're full of carbohydrates, so if you are trying to do keto or anything high protein, these probably aren't your go things, but they're really good for during your workout for high intensity. Um, at some point, I probably just need to buy an actual container because I've actually probably bought like six of these little things now. This is the Cookies and Cream Quest Protein. It is 100 calories. One fiber, seven carbs, 20 protein. They actually have like little cookie pieces in them. It's really good. I really like this stuff. Uh, once again, I don't really eat these for like a breakfast, so I'd eat them more uh, later evening if I needed um, more protein, stuff like that. Uh, so these uh, plant stuff didn't apply. However, they're only a dollar, and I like the vanilla bean tort. So I got two of them. Um, I don't know what's really to share about them. I think everyone knows about nectar proteins. This was a go-to protein of mine. I'll still have it occasionally. It's a little sweet, but it's pretty good. Uh, the other thing I stocked up on, I think I bought like four of these, are the com Combat uh, Birthday Cake. So, they're pretty good. This one, um... I don't I should do like a comparison of this one and the one bar. I probably like these ones a little bit better, but like these are really thick and filling and um, I don't know. They're a little bit different from each other. The oh yeah, one bar actually came out with a chocolate birthday cake. I really want to find that. I haven't seen it yet. My last oh yeah, one bar is uh, this one. It is mint chocolate chip. I haven't tried it yet. I'm not a huge fan of mint chocolate chip. I may not even eat this. I may actually give it to my sister because I've been looking for it to give it to her. Um, I didn't know that Vitamin Shop had this next product. Uh, pretty happy that I saw that they did because I 
ran out of the other stuff that I used to have. So this is Flapjack Protein Pancake Baking. They have a ton of peanut butters now. They have a ton, well, Flapjack doesn't have a ton of peanut butters, but Vitamin Shop has a ton of pancake mixes and peanut butters. Like, I've never seen that many. It used to be so hard to find that stuff, and now it's all over the place. So, for a half a cup, it is 200 calories. Here, I guess I can show you. It is 200 calories, 20 protein, 23 carbs, uh, 5 fiber. So, if you're looking for pancakes. Now, the next thing, I actually am going to do a taste test because I haven't tried it. There's like oils coming off of this thing. So, I don't know if it was like around oils or if it just is oily. Um, it is the Buff Bake Snickerdoodle. I haven't had it yet, so I'm going to go ahead and give it a try. I brought out some apples to give it a try with. This thing is so oily. So, it has a lot of oils in it right now, so I'm actually going to try to mix it a little bit. It's kind of weird. Take it away from the camera. Sorry, this part isn't very entertaining. I'm just trying to get it all mixed up so that way I get a true taste. You can definitely see that it's pretty gritty looking. I think most peanut butters nowadays that are like protein-ish, okay, it's like my first, no, I'm not going to do that. Um, that little taste was good. I can like see cinnamon sugary stuff in here. That's really good. Ugh, jeez. Probably good I had a knife. Okay. So I've like made a total mess, so I'm gonna have to clean that up. Um to give you its stats, it is see it's so oily. Um 190 calories for two tablespoons, eleven protein, three fiber, how it seven? Seven carbs. Gosh, can't even open this. Okay. Let's see how it tastes. Sorry, I'm talking to my friend here, so I want to make sure that they're not here. They're getting close. So here's my apple and peanut butter. It's good. Um, you can't expect it to be like regular peanut butter. It is gritty, but has a good taste to it. It definitely has a snickerdoodle taste. Um, I would definitely eat this. I'm probably good on banana too. More bread we do bread um it's a lot better than I totally just got peanut butter on my leg dang it I got another like protein peanut butter before sometimes they're not very good this one's pretty good so I'm gonna end this video if you guys have any questions on any of the props, oh, there's one product I didn't show. Mmm, there are a couple products I didn't show. Shoot. Sorry. Um, I didn't talk. I got B B P I Sports Snow Cone. It is a BCAA. I wanted to try something a little bit different for recovery. I used it once. I had a really shitty workout in general, so I don't want to base it off that workout, but I will probably tell you more later about this one. Environment shop. You go in there now, there's always a ton of shoes. So I got a couple of them since everything is a little bit cheaper right now. 
These are also on sale. Uh, here's a probiotic one. The COQ10. So this one, I guess, is for um, inflammation. So like, I don't know. And this one. I'm actually hoping this one tastes a little bit better than the one I... I found the past was good. But I had one. Um, I haven't opened any of them. I had a sample in the store. It tastes really bad. So I'm hoping it's better. Okay. That's officially everything. One more thing with the peanut butter. I finished eating the apples. It's actually really good. I recommend the peanut butter. Um, one thing that kind of explains a little bit of the taste is it is an almond butter type spread. And I just want to talk about the ingredients. Um, like you can actually read all the ingredients. So I really like that. So it's roasted almonds, whey protein, coconut palm sugar, cinnamon, coconut oil, chai seed, and flaxseed. I recommend this. They do have samples. So if you don't want to commit, you can get a sample size too. And they have a ton of other flavors, but that's all.